we're back. It is nice to see you all for the first video of 2024. And thank you for tuning in because hiking season is almost in full swing and almost underway. There's still some snow high up in the mountains. So today we are down low in the mountains where it is mostly melted. And we are doing something a little bit different here on the channel that we've never really done before. And that is that we are out hunting for morel mushrooms. This is only my second time ever really hunting for morel mushrooms, but we have found some. It's been a pretty interesting day. And if you guys wanna follow along on our journey today and to see how we did, I'm gonna start you back down at the trucks. If you guys enjoyed this video, be sure to leave a big thumbs up on it, comment down below and subscribe to the channel. And let's get out and hunt some morel mushrooms. Thanks for watching. So I've only been morel picking one time, and that was a week ago. Um, I had a friend take me along who is very, very good at finding them, and we went to this very spot, and we found a few, a good handful, uh, but it seemed like it was just a bit early. Um, they were pretty small morels, and so here we are back about a week later um, after a good couple of warm days and some rain. And then actually last night was probably one of the coldest nights that we had left in this year. Uh, you can see on the ground, we've got a skiff of snow, which I don't know if that's going to make it harder to find morel mushrooms. I don't have the eye for them. So if I find one today, it'll actually be the first time I've ever found one on my own because the ones that we found last week were all by my friend. I do not have the eye for them. So I'm hoping that we can get lucky and maybe find a few of our own mushrooms, but this is gonna be a good day. It's gonna be a good way to kind of get in hiking shape for the summertime. And I'm really just kind of excited to be out here. So while we're on the topic of mushrooms, I wanted to show you guys something that I've been trying and sampling out for the last 20 days or so. This is Magic Mind. I hope you guys can see that. Uh, but what it is, is it's a mental performance shot that comes in this little two ounce bottle. And it contains basically 100% natural ingredients that are used to improve energy, decrease stress, decrease procrastination, and really just improve your mental clarity. And one of the active ingredients in it is lion's mane, a mushroom which is used to enhance focus. And and after taking this guy for 20 days, I have absolutely fallen in love with this stuff. Again, it's increased my energy. And what I do is I usually take it with my morning coffee and it kind of enhances the effects of that. So all you want to do is shake it up really well. And then what I like to do is just shoot it. And it's really good. It's kind of sweet. It tastes like greens. And I really just enjoy the taste of it. So basically to recap, after taking this for 20 days, I felt amazing. And I highly recommend you guys check this out if it's something you're into. Now, if you're interested in checking Magic Mind out for yourself and want to experience all the benefits just as I have, be sure to check the link down below in the description box and use the discount code DannyShafer20 for up to 56% off your first subscription. I found one. Yes. <laughs> I know it sounds dumb to be so excited about finding a mushroom, but when you haven't, found one yet it's pretty uh it's pretty satisfying to find let me show you what we got Let's see if you guys can see it right there so i was taught to cut them just like that. And that, my friends, is our first morel. Now, if one were to find a rabbit's foot, would that mean good luck? Found some. These are pretty small. There's like five in a little bunch right here. But we'll take it. There we go. Got 
one, two, three, four, five. And there's a few more around. I watched Lolly step on one. These are pretty tiny little guys. That's okay. And then I saw one more right here. There's the rope. No. <laughs> There's one, two, three more. So we just found eight morels. So just found another mushroom. It's not a morel, and we're not going to pick it. But I believe this one is called. Gyometra montana, I believe. I think that's the genus of it, but also known as like calf brain, calves brain, and there's a bunch of different names for it. Um, somebody else can probably fill me in more down in the comments, but it's a member of like the false morels, and some people say you can eat it, some don't. I'm not really sure, so I'm not going to eat it, um, but I just wanted to point it out. I'll show you kind of a little bit closer as to what it looks like. Man, kind of slim pickings today. <laughs> we have found some, which has been kind of fun, um, but definitely, definitely some slim pickings. So I uh, just wanted to mention to you guys super quick, um, kind of moving forward here on the channel, what we have planned for the summer of 2024. And the two big things that come to mind is for where we're going this summer and what I kind of want to like do is we've got one big trip planned one big hike planned, I should say, and we have to fly across a bunch of water to get there. <laughs> so that'll actually be happening in the next couple of weeks. And then the really big one that I wanna crush this summer is I wanna go back to the Cabinet Mountains over in Montana, and I just want to do that through hike that uh, we failed on last summer and actually get it done. And I think I'm gonna do it probably just by myself with Lolly and we're probably going to knock it out all 25 30 miles and it's going to be it's going to be pretty awesome. Um I kind of find myself with the hiking and backpacking game getting out of the mindset of just wanting to do like through hikes and just kind of the the normal standard stuff and I'm wanting to get into the off the path type of trails where I make my own routes. I find the mountain lakes that haven't really been documented or haven't really been seen that most people haven't been to and I wanna find those. I want to buy a pack raft and pack raft across an unknown mountain lake to get to the other side to continue a hike. Um, I wanna buy a hot tent so I can camp um, later into the year when there's snow out and still be warm that's kind of the stuff that I really find myself getting excited about and to film and that I want to share with you guys. So that's kind of what I want to bring moving forward into this channel, at least at this current stage in my life while I can still do that kind of intense type of hiking. So that's what I'm planning on this summer. And then of course, um, just wanting to stay pretty local and knock out a lot of these mountain lakes and peaks here in North Idaho and the surrounding areas. So that's kind of what I wanted to tell you guys. That's what I want to do and what you'll be seeing 
uh, this summer. So uh, we're getting pretty close to ending our morel mushroom hunt. We've got a pretty good uh, hip pocket full. I don't know. It's about half full. <laughs> But it's been a fun day hiking around nonetheless. We've gotten to come outside and I think Lolly's starting to get a little bit tired. She's just sitting on a log <laughs> right now. Um, but we're probably going to start making our way down to the road and then back to the truck. Um, but we got a little bit of a haul. So hope you guys have enjoyed the video so far. And we'll start making our way back down to the truck. We've got a third one right here, but I'm going to leave it. I'll let it grow. All right, you guys, we made it back to the truck. In total, we hiked a little over four miles, a little over 400 feet of elevation gain, and a good handful here of morels, mushrooms. You know, this is only my second time ever hunting for them, and they were pretty small, so I'm curious if it's still just a little bit early in the season. But we got to get out, we got to do a little bit of hiking, and I hope you guys kind of enjoyed this little adventure, uh, early hiking season for us here in North Idaho. Uh, if you liked this, be sure to leave a big thumbs up on it, comment down below, subscribe to the channel, and we will see you on the next video of an actual real hike. It's almost season. We will see you guys then. Thank you guys so much for watching.